For what I'm about to do, I need many rooms. These words were a catalyst of confidence that God had plans and purposes for Kuala Lumpur. Capacity and opportunity needed to be created for the kingdom of God to be revealed. This is Joel and Emma in Kuala Lumpur in Malaysia, and we are having the best time here, Southeast Asia. So a team of six led by Pastor Joel and Emma moved from the UK in September 2014 to pioneer a local church that would introduce people to God, lead them to a breakthrough and relationship with Him, and in turn, release them into a purpose to reach the city and beyond. Firstly, with dinner party gatherings in the homes of our teens, which we still prioritize to this day and have helped us form authentic and faith-building friendships. We DIY renovated a shop lot in Publica Mall and we began church in April 2015 as part of the multi-site church which sent and supported us in the first few years. After a year, we relocated and went pop-up event style at various venues within APW Bangsar. It was a versatile space and definitely helped us build team find a groove, and learn a lot. At the start of 2020, we took on the lease for the premises we meet in now. All of our Hope City members, welcome. Anyone else out there who's just joining in just for the fun of it, <laughs> welcome. What seemed like a terrible timing for a 24-7 space actually helped our church pivot to online and serve the community struggling through the pandemic. We gained a sense of permanence and a base to operate from when everything felt so online and distant. Through the generosity of our church, we moved everything online and kept the lights on to be able to launch out again in November 2021. Since then, we've seen new demographics begin to grow in strength with families and now teens beginning to gather too. This community has grown numerically, but God refined us through the pandemic and reopening season so that we now know more of who He's called us to be. We look back on this first volume of the story so far with great gratitude for all God has done in and through each of us. Since planting ourselves in this church, we witnessed how God has been so faithful to us and our family. God has transformed me and He's definitely shown me what a real relationship with Him is like. A relationship based on trust and love. I believe our church has came a long way from a mini church in Joe's apartment all the way to Fabrika, Bangsa and PJ. I think the journey has been exciting. It's amazing how far we've come from Pastor Joe's initial planning idea like from my vision, and now we have this incredible community and space. I mean, in the early days, uh, we certainly moved around a lot, and we did a lot of setting up and tearing down. God taught me the value of seasons, and putting the right people at the right time in church to guide me through my difficult times. Church has definitely been really important to me as it shaped a different perception uh, towards Christianity. Personally, God has also taught me a lot about forgiveness uh, and healing with people around me and also myself. I feel challenged by God to grow spiritually and to change certain areas of my life for the better. You know, I'm definitely still working on deepening my relationship with God, but I love it here because there's always someone willing to journey with you. As we spend time to serve and build this church, we can really sense that God is also building and shaping our lives. I wouldn't be able to carry that peace and joy wherever I go without having a church to experience God every Sunday. Looking ahead, I'm really excited about our church growing and our connections getting really stronger as a community. Uh, what excites me about the future is that everything that we have sown in this church that I have reaped will also be reaped by everyone else and that the expansion of the kingdom via inclusion is what I'm most excited about. What excites me about the future is seeing more people come to God, seeing their hearts soften and transform. And I think I'm really excited to be able to journey with them, just like how other people have journeyed with me. I'm looking forward to see how God will continue to use this space that He has created for whatever plans that He has for this church. In this next season, I'm really excited to see more people experience God's faithfulness in their lives and also to see their relationship with Christ continue to thrive. 
I really believe God's doing amazing things in our church, so I'm excited to be a part of it. Definitely the next phase of our church will be really exciting as we welcome more people in. We have the avenue for them to uh, experience God and most importantly, their lives change and lives transform. Sunday services are hosted by over a hundred volunteers who put their talents and time into creating spaces, moments of encounter and warm hospitality. Today, people that walked in just looking for a church now participate in or lead teams. They preach, facilitate meaningful events, baptize people and host our services. Bible training, discipleship and courses have helped grow and mature us. Opportunities to serve has grown our character and expanded our capacity for others and the things of God. Many have met and married, started families and or businesses, made lifelong friendships and seen friends and family find God too. There is no limit to what God can do when we surrender to His plans and partner with Him to build His kingdom. The invitation is open to many more of your friends, family, colleagues and acquaintances who are yet to know the difference that living to worship God makes. This is our story so far and we hope you'll help us write the next installment.